Hey guys, this is Conspiracy Todd, and I've got a really good video tonight. It's called The Moon Landing Hoax, As Clear as Black and White. Okay, and then here is the evidence that I found. This right, what you're looking at is the same thing on the moon. Uh, this side over here, it looks black, and this side over here, it looks white. Both of these pictures were taken under pretty much the same conditions. It's daylight on the moon. And why is this one black and this one white? It should be exactly the same, you would think. Let me digress and tell you a little background here of what you're looking at. Okay, so this is a picture supposedly taken from Apollo 12. One of the astronauts took a picture of the other one. Okay, now this is the limb they supposedly landed on the moon in, and they walked around over here, and they took some pictures of this thing right here. What is this? This is an unmanned spaceship called Surveyor 3 that landed on the moon in April of 1967. Now, they supposedly landed here in their limb in uh, November of 1969, two and a half years later. Anyway, this is, I believe, to be a fake Surveyor 3. But anyway, the real one looked just like it, but it, it has this camera here, and this camera could rotate around here. This thing could rotate 360 degrees, and this little mirror here could go up and down, so it could basically take a picture of everything around it. And some of the pictures it took of its own self, and what it, the what you saw a while ago, the black and white uh, pictures, the uh, ones on the left over here were taken by the actual Surveyor 3 that was on the moon that landed in April of 67. And it's taken pictures of the top of this compartment A is what it's called. Now, the astronauts also took pictures of the top of compartment A. In all the pictures they took, the top of it looks white. In all of the pictures that the Surveyor 3 took, of this, it, it looks black. The reason it looks black, the way it's supposed to look, is because the top of this compartment was a mirror. And I will prove that to you now. Drew X Machina, he talks about the Surveyor 3. Here's a diagram of it. Compartment A, compartment B. But here he talks about all of the temperature sensitive electronics were carried in two thermal boxes. And they were uh, the tops were covered in by mirrored glass thermal regulators. So mirrored glass thermal regulators. And as I'm said before, none of the NASA defenders, the defenders of NASA, the ones that think that that say we really went to the moon, none of them are saying it's not a mirror. So keep that in mind. So the pictures here that the astronauts took, it appears to me that it's a white painted, it's like a shiny white surface that you can see a reflection in. I've got a short little video I want to show you. All right, I've set up a little demonstration here to illustrate what I'm talking about here. Well, now we have black and white. We have a mirror. We have a mirror. It's reflecting the blackness of space above. And we have a white shiny surface my car and you'll notice the lower the angle closer to zero you get here it reflects what's above it so does that look similar to you i mean this is the shine this is the top of my car what we have a painted white metal surface and we have the same thing over here in my opinion this is a painted white metal surface this is not in my opinion, a mirror. If it was a mirror, it would be reflecting the darkness of space above like this mirror is doing. What this mirror is doing. This mirror is reflecting the darkness of space above. This is not a mirror. This is white painted metal, just like the surface of my car right here. Okay, so you can tell that this is in direct sunlight because this thing right here is lit up like it's lit up by the sun. And um, that's the surface you're seeing right here on the side. These are taken from different views or different angles. Another thing, you don't see this piece of plastic sticking out the side, which should be about right here. And also in this other picture,
another view of it. The plastic should be sticking out right here. Also, notice how flat these are and how not flat these are. This is a cheap replica, I believe. Technical Memorandum 33-355 from NASA. Okay, they're talking about the surveyor thermal switch, keeping it below a certain temperature. The, the surface of the moon they were predicting would get up to 230 degrees, and they wanted to keep it below 120, and they did it by using a mirror on the top of this thing. This is not a mirror. And this is showing a diagram of this switch that they designed. Didn't work very well, it actually stuck. But uh, it was ha actually had four pieces here. And there's actually nine of these switches on here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. And uh, please comment below. Please like and subscribe if you like. And tell me what you think of my video.